almost one o'clock. Then uh, we get down, and then we're gonna concentrate on the uh, Tropidelamus uh, subanalatus down at the bottom, which I haven't sh shown you yet. And then we get in the room, yeah. so we'll take a break here. Yeah, there are the rest of the trail, which from here it will take us about 45 minutes to an hour to reach the uh, Pandan Kachil Trail. That's what they call it. They're just let me point out in the map where we are. So. It's right here. Uh -huh. So Pandan Kichil tra uh, Trail is lead us to one of the most beautiful beach in the park and then with a very pretty high cliff. Uh, uh, you probably have seen one of the rock pictures mm -hmm. like a sea stack. This is actually like a similar like a tour for fossils back in Australia and um, the sea conditions were a bit rough. Usually we could take take the boat so we don't have to walk back the same way but it's difficult for the boat to land on the beach side right now so then I decided to maybe we could concentrate on this side because most of the animal sightseeing in this side I mean, I, I would say that it's supposed to help human a lot, I mean, the palm oil, but then it's turned up to be the other way around. Yeah. Mm -hmm. As we lean so much on the fossil fuel, so uh, bio yeah. diesels like, mm. or oil like that could help, but it turned to be like a cancer now, mm. bit, bit killing. The first water bottles that came into my village is back in 1986. Yeah. And I remember when uh, during that time, someone out from outside the village mm. were so proud drinking uh, a water yeah. from these bottles and like, I drink water. Yeah. yeah because they have bottles. And then since then, we get a lot of plastics, yeah. a lot and a lot mm. and a lot of plastics. Yeah. Do you find more uh, snakes during the day or at night here? Both. Both. Yes. Yeah. Like um, typical snake species. Yep. Uh, uh, mostly find it uh, like from the genus uh, Dendrolepis. Of course, you only find them in the daytime, and then um, as well as Chrysopelia. Sure. Yeah, but uh, Boiga, I found it mostly nighttime. Mostly nighttime. Yeah. And. I've seen, I would say that Bungarus, the illipid families of snakes, mainly I find it during night time. Night time, yeah. yeah. From Bungarus to Kaliopis and of course Naja. Right. Yeah. Different species call different times. Yeah. They all start at the same time? Yeah, like... <coughs> then start with another species in. Yeah. yeah. And we call it redan here. We use this for fishing. Yeah. We dry it and then use, uh, use as a... Yeah. As a rod? Yeah. This one you see? This one is a stingless bean nest. Oh, yes! Yeah. Oh, oh, wow! Oh, yeah, we saw some of them in... Now you can buy the honey. It's very famous now. Yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah, they do it. Oh, and the honey is inside the tree hole. Yeah. yeah. It's a bone green viper. Uh huh. This one is a sub adult. 
Yep. And the grow can be like two meter, one meter long. At least. One meter long. What do they usually feed on? Uh, small, like gecko. Yeah. They feed on frog. Also. Yep. Uh, Tropidelamus subanalatus is uh, one of one of the species, uh, complex species. Is we, they already split it from wagglers. They used to be known as a wagglers spit viper before, mm -hmm. but they have split the species. So the result that we don't have the wagglers spit vipers here, but we do have Subanilatus or uh, <laughs> a Borneo keel pit viper. Awesome. K e e l d. You can see on the keel scale yeah. on on both sides of it. Yeah. Oh yeah, we're gonna. This is, I would say, readily common species. Yeah, mostly common species. Mm -hmm. Oh wow. <laughs> so healthy. So tell, talk us through this. Nepenthes fraplisiana. Uh huh. Yeah. They're even healthier. Yeah. A lot of people thought. It's a flowers, but actually yeah. no, it's a modification leaf. And that's how they adapt themselves to this harsh surrounding. Okay. And of course these orchids in the ants plant. Ant plants, we know that it's epiphytic plants that helping the host. Yeah. It's a perfect uh, symbiosis. It is because that ants is not be able to make the nest on the ground, but then they live here inside the, the this ants plant oh. so that's an ants nest the, no it's an ant plant oh, but ant plant. Okay. it's a plant but ants live in there as right, the right. ants move around bring back the food and feed the symbiotic house mm -hmm. and together they will protect uh protect the host from these probably parasitic plant like the orchid is uh epiphytic as well when it's epiphytic, it's symbiosis. Mm. Yeah. But we do have a combination of both, of, uh, of, of epiphytics and parasitic. That is uh, a ficus benjamina, semi-epiphytic uh, semi plants. The epiphytes, when they are young, when they take over yeah. the host, kill it. <laughs> yeah. So now we are actually near the river, near the coastal side. As you get to see, um, the forest is colonized by these palm trees. This is uh, Oncosperma tigellaria or Nibong palm. When we get on the boat, remember that you get to see the fishing things made. Uh, my people even use this palm to make, I mean, to build a house. Oh, yeah. yeah. So it's uh, a mangrove a little bit further, could be less than uh, less than uh, 300 meters. It's a mangrove forest, and then this palm will colonize up there. Yeah. And right up there, it's a bit similar to the Kuban National Park, mixed the paracut. Flying. I was like, Four line, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. The line on the back. It's a new one for us. Yes, a new one for us. <laughs> Another frog. Um, yeah. Musk. Musk. Yeah. Probably this one. 
is uh, restricted to this area, the pumpy area, mm. like this water. Okay. Yeah, hoping that we get to see some some nocturnal birds. Cool. Yeah, uh, as well. Do you get an okay? Yeah, we do. Yeah. Okay, we do have a buffy fish house. Oh, cool. Ooh, we saw and, um, and um, this small owl, I wasn't so sure what to do it. Cool. Yeah. Make it sound like sss. Sss. Yeah. Wow! Yeah. Oh, Check it. Cool. It's got centipede. like a uh, centipede, like a hey, boreal scorpion. Boreal scorpion. Is it a gliding scorpion? Oh. <laughs> That's nightmares. Yeah. 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 <laughs> it's not the same, but like a male. That's what we saw before. Most of people like they not realize that we have this so diverse species mm -hmm. with many colors, forms, different habitat, and mm. so on. So actually, yeah, we try to promote this kind of things to others so that um, to add on the values to certain national park. Thanks for coming up here and thanks for coming visiting this national park. Yeah. yeah.